Hello and welcome to another episode of Historically Marked. I am Jason in Shelbyville, Illinois, where there's a very special monument located here. So let's see a show of hands. How many of you own a dishwasher? I'm talking about, of course, the thing that makes the one of the best fancy kitchen appliances that we all take for granted. Or then there's some of us that, you know, hand wash our dishes, which I had no problem with at all. But the dishwasher, one of the inventors of the dishwasher, the modern dishwasher, um was right here right where i'm standing well close to nearby but there's a monument um just next to me and i'll go ahead and show you that here we go so that, so just one thing to keep in mind is this is private property i mean behind the sidewalk so don't disturb anybody in that house but here's what the monument says in a woodshed located at the rear of this site in 1886 mrs josephine garris cochran who lived from 1839 to 1913, invented one of the first mechanical dishwashers ever built. She exhibited her patented machines at the Columbian Exposition, or the World's Fair rather, in Chicago in 1893, winning the highest award. Thus was born over 100 years ago. The progenitor, the, ugh, the progenitor of today's KitchenAid dishwasher, the brainchild of one of America's first female inventors, a woman from Shelbyville, Illinois, and this was dedicated on September 18th, 1993. I think the back says the same thing. So yeah, I mean, it's cool to give a woman like her credit for this, but unfortunately, um, the dishwasher has kind of been a work in progress. So the question on everyone's minds is, should Cochran take all the credit for inventing the dishwasher? Well, unfortunately, in 1850, um, a guy named Joel Houghton in the United States um, invented the first mechanical dishwashing device and it was registered for a patent in 1850. Now this device was made of wood and was cranked by hand while water sprayed onto the dishes. The device was both slow and unreliable, but 15 years later a guy named L.A. Alexander um, had another patent for a dishwasher. and. Neither device was practical or widely accepted. Now, some historians cite as an obstacle to adoption the historical attitude that valued women for the effort put into housework rather than the results. Making household chores easier was perceived by some to reduce their value. But arguably the most successful of the hand-powered dishwashers was invented in 1886 by again Cochran. And she did it with the mechanic George Butters in her own tool shed. So Cochran, I mean, I don't know how rich she became because of it, but however, she was already rich. She was actually a wealthy socialite, and she always loved um, having guests over and serving it on China. Well, she wanted easier ways to do that, and that was her motive of um, making the dishwasher. So maybe she just didn't want to work or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> a lot of stuff I can get into about that, but... Um, goes without saying, yes, she was, um, again, very successful and won first prize and it helped lead the way to making it one of the best um, inventions. And I know it's kind of hard to believe that it was made during the 19th century. Now, during the mid 20th century, um, dishwashers and kitchens became very common. And early in 20th century, uh, electrical one was made in the United Kingdom by a guy named William Howard Livens. But still, <laughs> it's very cool that it actually originated on this site. And again, it's private property, so just kind of be respectful. But during the 1950s and 1960s, and especially, you know, to present day, I mean, dishwashers, they're a common thing in today's kitchen or modern kitchen, I guess, what, what have you. <laughs>
Hi, thanks so much for tuning into this episode of Historically Marked. I am Jason in Shelbyville, Illinois, just next to the Dishwasher Monument, as it's called locally. All right, I'm signing off.